Mutual fund capital gain distributions. The pain being felt by investors could get much worse by year end, even if markets recover from here. This fall, mutual funds will begin releasing information on capital gain dividends to be paid out prior to year end. This means that you could be paying taxes on capital gain dividends at the same time that you have investment losses on your mutual funds if you're not careful. Let's talk about who might get hit with these capital gain dividends and how to plan to mitigate the damage while you still have some time. As of the end of July 2022, 97% of mutual funds, active and passive, had negative returns. Dating back to 2001, this is the worst year for performance, even worse than during the great financial crisis in 2008, when considering the breadth of the losses. While year-to-date equity returns are not worse than 2008, the current significant weakness in fixed income pushes the total number of funds with losses in 2022 significantly higher than in 2008. The breadth of funds at a loss have not been seen since 2001. Despite these losses on most mutual funds, there's an increased likelihood that they could distribute capital gain dividends this year due to substantial outflows from actively managed mutual funds and increased trading in the volatile market on the back of a high performing 2021. Remember, whenever there's a redemption of a mutual fund, it must sell securities to raise cash, which could create capital gain distributions for investors that still hold the fund. The last time we had this breadth of funds at a loss was 2001, and in the five years since 2001, when mutual funds had net outflows, 53% of funds on average paid cap gain dividends. And in terms of the most similar year to 2022 for the performance, we look no further back than to 2018 when markets nearly fell into bear market and rates rose. Does this sound familiar? In that environment in 2018, 61% of funds pay capital gain distributions. Given the comparisons between the breadth and depth and losses to mutual funds this year, estimates are that nearly one third of active mutual funds with losses will distribute capital gains before the year is over. If you own a mutual fund that is down for the year, underperforming its benchmark, and has historically paid a capital gain, perhaps it's time to consider cutting your losses before a bad situation gets worse. Harvesting the losses from your portfolio and swapping into an indexed ETF could lower your portfolio costs and increase its tax efficiency. So be on the lookout for mutual fund capital gain distributions, the hidden tax. Are you prepared for retirement? Schedule a free financial assessment with an experienced financial professional right online at purefinancial.com.